In this video, I'll show you how to use an Apple gift card for in-app purchases. If you're new to the channel, please go down below and consider subscribing. And once you've done that, please go down below and consider leaving a like. And let's jump straight into this guide. Here we are on my device and let's get right into this. So the first thing you need to do is open up your app store just like so. And once it loads, what you need to do is go to your account page. So you can go and get to this page from any of these, you know, today games app, they're all gonna get there. And then what you need to do is go and tap on the profile button in the top right of the app store, which looks like a silhouette of a single person. Then the account page will load. And what you need to do is make sure you've got some gift card balance. And from the account page to go and view how much balance you have, all you need to do is go and tap in your name and email at the top, just like so. Then you can go and see your balance just here. As you can see, I've got £6.62. Then you can go and press done. And if you want to go and redeem one, then all you need to do is go back to the account page and go and tap on redeem gift card or code. Now, in order to go and use it when completing an in-app purchase, I'm gonna go and show you how to do this. I'm going to make an in-app purchase in Roblox. So I'm gonna go and tap on um, a purchase just like so, and it's gonna take a moment to load. And then you're gonna go and get the Apple Pay pop-up. Then as you can see, we go and you need to go and select your payment card. Well, the app source is gonna automatically go and use your gift card balance up before it goes and charges your card. So in this case, because um, this is an 89p charge and a cost, uh, I can go and purely use my gift card balance. But as far as I remember correctly, my gift card balance are about six pounds. So if I was spending more than six pounds, then what I'd have to go and do is I'd then go and use uh, my gift card up and then any remaining charge left would be put on my card. 